Hello, everyone. Um, my name is Bernard Mulu. I am the Chief Operation Officer for RidePass. So RidePass is a ride-sharing platform that is built specifically for small um, communities that are underserved and ignored by Uber and Lyft. And um, we launched in August of 2017, but we've actually been working on the platform since 2016. So, and we currently generate over $1,000 in monthly recurring revenue. And um, as you can see on the next slide, um, why we are all, uh, uh, my team is made up of um, all um, people that went to Whitewater. And while in Whitewater, we realized that we had a huge problem for, for with transportation. The only system of transportation we had in Whitewater at that time was um, called Brown Cap. It's a cap, it's a cap company that you would call that wait time was ridiculously long, about 30 minutes. So we, when we all graduated, we decided to create a solution to that, to to cater for college students and to, to solve the, pro the, the problem of drinking and driving in, in, in these college communities. So we started working on this platform right past. And as you can see on the screen in front of you, um, there are usually no drivers available from Uber or Lyft. But um, with right pass, the the, 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 we, we are currently available on Google Play and the Apple App Store. And um, we, the, our process is really simple. You just open up the app, you put in your destination, then you request the ride, and um, a driver shows up um, at, at your front door. It's pretty simple. So this is how um, our app looks like. Um, over to the right. Over to the right, you have um, over to the right, you have the request right now, and then to the left, you have the option to schedule a ride for later. So if you have an appointment later, you can just schedule the ride, and um, you would have um, a driver pick you. You will have uh, a, a, a driver pick you up at that specific time. So we have several features, but there are two key features that I would like to explain to you guys today. First is our Ride Pass money system, which allows um, parents to preload their account, to, to preload the account of students. Um, and now the students can now use this money towards their ride as they are in college. And this brings the peace of mind from the parents' perspective because they know that their, their, their child doesn't, their child has access to safe ride um, while on campus. So we launched in August of 2017, and we have been growing our user base at approximately, we have been growing our user base at approximately 33%, as well as our revenue at approximately 20%. So our revenue model is pretty simple. Um, the drivers keep 80% of the ride, and we, we keep 20% for processing the transaction. So after doing our market research, we realized that um, a huge, there's a huge part of the community that doesn't have access to rideshare community. And um, this gives us an estimate of about 5 million students in these types of community. And um, so for 2018, the ride-sharing market is, has a total addressable market of about 15 $0.7 billion, but in these communities, the total addressable market is only about, it's, it's going to be about $65 million, and, and um, with a total user base of about $5 million. So we are specifically, we are going specifically to these um, small underserved communities that um, don't have access to Uber or Lyft, and um, currently we are we, we, we are providing these services in Whitewater, as in, in Whitewater City, as well as the neighboring cities of Whitewater. Um, this is our team over here. We have Patrice Achu, our CEO and founder. And we have myself over here. Um, I am Bernard Mulu. And we have our CTO, Patrice Achu. 
he or the, we are all um we are all um we all went to UW Whitewater. Thank you for listening at Right Pass. We are building communities one ride at a time. <laughs>